Hey everybody, White Darkness 740 here, bringing you another Let's Play. We're going to Let's Play today, Journey to Silius for the NES, but with a little twist. If you've seen my uh, trailer for this Let's Play, you'll know that the story has been changed, meaning that I actually made my own storyline for this Let's Play. Um, the reason why I've done this is for two reasons. One, uh, Journey to Silius has been known to have like been a Terminator game in Japan, or actually planned to be a Terminator game for the American audience, but due to uh, license, their license being uh, removed, they had to turn it into an actual game with a different storyline. And they also changed the name, and they also changed the storyline a little bit more in the Japanese version. So I thought, why not make my own story into it? The second reason is, if you haven't known yet, or haven't seen the background of my channel, um, I actually have my own channel characters, uh, which is Mariko, Honika, Masayo, and Melody. Uh, Masayo and Melody might not isn't going to be in this uh, let's or the storyline, and Masayo hasn't been introduced yet, so uh, that's probably why that's mostly why they're not in this. Um, so yeah, also. Uh, before I start this let's play, actually, um, I would kindly want like to ask if you would, um, if you do not like the storyline or the introduction that I've made myself, it kind of took a little while to do, seeing as uh, I had to fix my computer for a little while. Please don't add any uh, negative comments below. You will be, rem uh, your comment will be blocked, and I'm not gonna block you, but I'm gonna block the comment. I mean, it took a little bit of long time work to do this, so I hope you guys don't uh, bash on this real hard. With further ado, let's get started this Let's Play. First off, let's take a look at the cutscene again, but this time with me! Yay! In the year 2000X, fathers like Mega Man, the world has been taken over by Also, if you're asking, that is actually a flash animation I was trying to make, you know, like if the buildings were exploding. If you're confused, that's why. During the chaos, Honika was disappeared, and all that was left was a disc. If you ever want to see your Honika again, you will find us at the space station Silius, and you will have to defeat me and stop the station. a second thought, Mariko puts on a specialized and spacious suit uh, and heads off to the space station. Don't worry, Monica. I'm on my way. Journey to Silius. Uh, sorry if the if my voice is kind of uh, raising up, uh, I kind of edited my uh, microphone after that uh, clip. Anyways, yeah, Journey to Silius. Like I said, this is the first time I'm actually introducing my characters into my Let's Plays. And I, I kind of, it's kind of embarrassing to say this, but they're kind of like my uh, cheat in to, they're kind of like my pass to actually get an excuse for actually making a story. Because, uh, I don't know. I just want to make my videos interesting. You know, just... I know that there's a lot of people out there on YouTube that make a lot of Let's Plays. And they're basically the same thing. Just they're, just them playing the game. I want to actually make mine, my Let's Plays a little bit different. You know, title cards, introductions, even uh, storylines. But anyways, let's get started with this Let's Play. Uh, be right back. Stage one. Let's do this. Uh, as soon as I can remember my buttons. Okay, there we go. Uh, I was. I thought I set them on a rock. Uh, Mega Man rocks format. What I mean is like W S A D keys. Um. Yeah. Well, this is Journey to Silius. Not that much different. Um. If you if you actually, even though I don't want to reference my own uh things that I've made in previous videos or actually made for this video. 
into my videos, like re um, make a reference to them. Um, if you notice, if you look closely to uh, uh, the character's uh, sprite, you can see that uh, Mariko's suit from the cutscene is actually based off that. And I am doing terrible right now. I'm actually losing a lot of health. Oh, and I did not see that. And I did not see you. Oh crap! This is the this is a great start for this let's play, isn't it? Uh, and this game is very stingy on the health, only with weapon energy. Uh, speaking of weapon, weapon it. Okay, for a second there, I was gonna I was about to say speaking of death. Uh, let's see. All right, there we go. Uh, might as well show it off right now. Um, if you press start, you'll see your weapon screen. Uh, the way to select weapons is to uh, press start. I think. No wait. Uh, how do you select weapons again? I totally forgot. Uh, this is great. This is a great way to start a let's play. Um, I'm not sure. What, I don't know why my... Why it's not letting me choose the sh uh, shotgun. Uh, maybe I have my... I'll be right back. Alright, I figured it out. Uh, for some reason, my uh, select button is set to S for some reason. Anyways, if you press select, and now it doesn't. Oh, I wasn't. I didn't activate the uh, program. All right, if you press select, you'll uh, go to your next weapon, which is the shotgun. Uh, I'm not gonna use it right now, seeing as I'm low on health and I'm probably gonna die in the next few seconds. So I might as well use it when I uh, actually need it. Yep, there we go. Rico, you fail. Uh, I don't know. Eh. Speaking of Mariko and my other characters, I'm actually planning on redoing those uh, uh, character bio things. I didn't think they were really that good, mostly due to how I'm just spamming the, um, actually uh, overusing the time limit that I have now. You know, the extra 50. Ah. Jerk just got me from the back. Uh. In all my life of uh, playing pr uh, platform games, I have never had an enemy knock me into a pit. Well, maybe in Mega Man, but I mean, besides that. I mean, that's kind of usual. Or, or in Castlevania, obviously. Uh, kill you before you kill me. Speaking of that, um, I got that from Call of Duty. Um, speaking of Call of Duty, while my computer was out to get fixed, uh, it was mostly due to a uh, uh, memory problem because uh, I had so much data in my recovery system. I, I still actually don't know how to get rid of it, but I was able to get uh, rid of a, uh, tons of stuff so that way there was enough room. So my computer should be uh, acting more quickly. Um, while I was waiting for that, I actually, if you haven't noticed yet, uh, Redbox, the company that lets you bar uh, rent movies for a dollar. No, no, I'm watching too much Chuck Connor for that. Um, oh, we actually, here's our mini boss here. Uh, what you really want to do is, too bad I can't show it, uh, is that, oh, okay, maybe I can show it if I actually have an extra life. No, I don't. Uh, this is great. Well, this, at least it gives me more time to continue. There's unlimited continues like Ninja Gaiden, so there, so, um, quitting isn't an option here. Anyways, uh, I actually rented a game from, Re uh, uh, Redbox, and it was Call of Duty Black Ops for the Wii. Yeah, I'm I'm hardcore. I I play the Wii. Uh, to be honest, I like the Wii. It's not even though it's not the most powerful system and it has doesn't have the greatest graphics. I actually like it more than an Xbox or PlayStation. Anyways, uh, I was playing the game and I was having so much fun. I actually I actually bought two other games uh, previously before uh, renting it, which was for the GameCube actually, and I was enjoying them so much. And as soon as I got uh, Call of Duty Black Ops for uh, for my Wii. Um, you know, to rent, that is. Uh, I could not stop playing it. I mean, I could not stop uh, teaming up with other guys online uh, with zombies in multiplayer. And yes, I am a noob, so yeah, I kind of suck in multiplayer. I was being pwned left and right. Luckily, I was actually able to get to level 11 with a couple of rounds. Uh, anyways. Um, yeah, this is Journey of the Silius. Hooray! This, this part is just going longer than it should have due to very, very bad um, platforming skills. To be honest, I have never defeated Journey to Silly's before. This is actually, if I actually do this in this Let's Play, it's going to be a first time. 
kind of like how I defeat uh, first uh, finally defeated Doctor Wily with no with no other weapons and no well, actually no other weapons. I mean no E tanks you know, and Mega Man rocks. I just love that moment. That should go in like if I ever have like a top ten moments that should that should be in like number two. All right, now as soon as this boss appears, you're gonna want to jump over. That was great, and that was even better. I am just brilliant in this game, aren't I? Alright, what you want to do is wait for this character to come, jump over it, then duck. Okay, maybe I did that wrong. Oh wait, actually you were supposed to duck on the first shot and then... Oh, uh, I'm smart. Uh, should I die? I don't know, it's not my choice. This pattern mostly works. Uh, you just have to jump over his high shot and then uh, jump over his low shot and high, and duck under his high shot. See it? Oh, and I just had it. <sighs> what was that noise? It sounded like somebody just burped. Ugh. Yeah, I am not the best. I am not the best player in this game. Either, I mean, during uh, school, which right now it doesn't exist in summer, which is going to exist in three more weeks, uh, um, I was actually playing this while during one of my computer classes, and I was breezing through the first three stages. But right now, I'm just really bad at it. I don't know why. That was a nice shot. I don't know why, I was like really good, I was like killing enemies left and right, I had my eyes open for those little tiny enemies on the ground, and right now I'm just like, I'm like, I am just failing right now, uh, oh, okay, for some reason I did not get hit by that shot. Some random guys are shooting in the background, like he's just like, hey, uh, you know what, we should just shoot shots out of nowhere. Let's just see where it goes. Maybe we'll hit some random guy who's trying to save the world. Uh. Uh, anyways. Oh, God. I don't know. I'm thinking of... Uh, for some reason, I have the urge to do Let's Plays on very terrible games. Well, not like really terrible, just like very obscure games. Like, What I mean is that... It, if you know Chugga Conroy, he's mostly a Let's Player who does Let's Plays on games that are in a famous series but aren't really recognized that much. While I'm more of a person who likes to uh, dive into the depths of the NES library and find a... or any game library or anything like that, even indie games. And try to see the... wait, is this the boss? Yes, it is. Jump! Duck! No, wait, it was the other way around! I can do this. I cannot do this. You know what? I'm just gonna take the cheap way out. Uh, I hope this is a good idea. Now let's take on the shotgun and just wait. Just spam it in his face. Let's get our uh, machine gun. I actually just wanted to show you guys uh, how to take care of that mini boss easily, but I guess I'll have a second chance in the uh, next level. We got spoilers, he's coming back. Uh, anyways, here's a first boss of stage one, which is a helicopter that drops enemies. Uh, why do I get the feeling that I might fail at this too? Yes, I am gonna f uh. It's a whole new meaning to NES hard. Oh god, why did I say that? But really, I... For some reason, even though we live in the, even though I live in the year 2011, I'm I get like very good at, um, I get very terrible at NES games. But after playing them for like maybe a day or two, I just get like really good at him. I mean, if if I was to face an Xbox player playing this, if me and an Xbox player uh, were uh, finding out who can play an NES game way more better, I would probably win in a uh, on a landslide. This is mostly due to, uh, I don't know, I'm just used to platforming. Anyways, after you take care of the enemies that he drops, you're going to want to get out your sh uh, machine gun. And then, you're just going to have to wait for him to come down. 
And some we that is some weird uh, sprite animation on the bottom. Uh, you want to try to shoot him in the face as many times as you can. Don't worry about your health as long as you have tons of as long as you have half than more health or at least even less than half. I think you'll be fine. You just want to shoot in the face and that's it. He's gone. Gone. Anyways, you get your uh, health and weapon energy refilled, and it's on to stage two. But I think we're gonna do that in the next part, seeing as we did so much, so, so we did we did so well in this part. Anyways, if you like this part, subscribe to my videos. A uh, white little button. Give me a good thumbs up review down below this video, and check out my other parts if you like this one. In the next part, we're gonna take on stage two. See you guys later.